say it, amen? I want to say a very big happy birthday to our Father who has gathered us here today to glorify God for his life. Amen. Can you help me celebrate God for the gift of life, for his grace and mercy over his servant? Come on, give the Lord a big shout. Three minutes. And I'm going to stick to my time. Today, on this altar, I have seen Christianity practicalized in real terms. What will Jesus do if he was in this same position and he did exactly what Jesus would have done? I wish every other church is doing like this. I tell you Christianity for day very easy. I congratulate the youth of this church because the next generation of celebrities in the Christian dome will be rising from here. I am not praying. It is not a prayer. It is something that is visible to the ear and very audible to the eyes. I'm telling you, you cannot be having this kind of support and remain a mediocrity. No way. No way. Daddy, God bless you beyond your imagination. In the name of Jesus. And when he was giving those gifts, he came to a time, he said, this two million is for the widows. And then he added, real widows. Real widows. Reminded me of an incident that happened in my village. Some white men came to my village and they are missionaries. They came with good intention to take care of widows. And a, a village town hall meeting was called. All the widows, please come. As they come, you come outside. Um, what's your name? My name is so and so. You are a widow, yes. When did your husband die? Two years ago. They give her two million. Eh? The next one. When did your husband die? Four years ago. They give her four million. Huh? The next one, six years ago, they gave us six million. Hey, now see my mama, the waka come. She came. When did the husband die? She said 12 years ago. The Oibu was so wonderful. He gave her 12 million. Now all the village people begin to shout, Now nah, lie, oh, she not be widow. We know her husband. Her husband is in the house. We know the husband. The Oibu was perplexed. He said, no. She said, she's a widow. Why? Is it your widowhood? They said, no, we're not going to agree. The Oibo, because he's a missionary, he has to do the thing right. They now say, okay, you say you know the husband? They say, yes. Where is he? He's in the house. Oh, yeah, let's go to the house. I shocked when they reached my house. My father didn't know what was happening. They go to my house. Ah, good afternoon, sir. Yes, good afternoon. What's happening? Um, this woman said she's a widow and her husband died 12 years ago. And so she was given 12 million. When my father hear 12 million, actually we give, you know, widows money according to the number of the years their husband. Now my papa said, ah, this woman is a liar from the pit of hell. She is a liar. Her husband